Oh, I forgot I was hiding. Okay. Oh yeah, he went into the fucking area that I needed to go to. Shit, I can't believe I didn't see that before. Fuck this game and it's hidden this. See that? Are you doing? Leave the room. Oh shit. I don't think those were there before. Also, fuck. right in front of you. Project Paperclip, Joint Intelligence, Reference, Nazi War Crimes Disclosure Act. The first paperclip provides a means of obtaining services of foreign specialists for specific assignments within the technical services of the departments of Army, Navy, and Air Force. Project 63 is primarily a denial program with utilization as a desirable feature. The aim of this program is to secure employment in the United States of certain preeminent pre German and Austrian specialists, thus denying their services to potential enemies. How will you become relevant? Note.
And I'm bad at fucking finding things in this game tonight. Alright, laundry chute was this direction. <laughs> Oh. You're not leaving. Uh, I guess I have no fucking choice. Hey. Dude, just don't kill me. I'm just trying to get out. That was when he's going to attack me. Up, up, up. Fuck yeah, batteries. Thing. That thing scares the shit out of me. <gasps> shit all over my pants. All over the chair. Due to the wall fucker. I'm gonna have to follow him. Bravest journalist ever. Hooray. Exposition. Excerpt from blah blah blah. How can I not remember where the cuts are coming from? They hurt so deeply even days later. Dr. Newhouse tells me that it's my fault. I'm subconsciously resisting the hypnotherapy. But I want so much to get better. I don't know how I could be doing this to myself. Dr. Newhouse says it's another condition of my bedroom-inspired hysteria. Poor Bruce. I make him suffer, so... I've tried subtly to ask Mrs. Jackson if she had similar issues with her husband, but she is loath to talk about it. Her husband, too, has found comfort in a younger woman. I know the doctors only mean well, and with the help of the government men who've joined the staff, I am in the very best hands possible. I should just take my pills and sleep and hope for more pleasant dreams tonight. Holy crap, I thought that was a fucking dude just staring there. Standing there staring, I should say. Uh, ah, uh, nope. Later. 
Ah, damn you, game. It's fucking dark, yeah. Follow the blood. There is no blood. Those are the fucking naked bros. Dick dangle McGee. I bet this is going to fall. Oh no, it fell. That is a sturdy camera. That I did not expect. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, uh, dark. Alright. Man, the lighting in this game is fucking good sometimes. Holy shit, man. <gasps> I missed my fucking light. Just fall. Oh, I see.
Fuck that. I am gonna get eaten by a fucking Gru or something heading in that direction. Shit. Shit. Fucking shit. I need to go that way. Pretty sure I'm gonna go that way. There it is. There it is. Just fucking pick it up, you idiot! Oh my god, I hate you right now. It's right in front of you. Why can you not grab it? Pick up a friggin' thing! Okay. Yay. Oh! Later. Oh shit! Ah, oh, that's fucking cool. Mm, close the door. Close the fucking door! Nice. <laughs> Ooh, fucking getting tired. I'm alive. up when I go to new areas. I love how everybody has a fucking fireplace. <laughs> I 
Yeah, sorry if that sneeze scared the shit out of you. I know, it was sudden. Oh crap. <laughs> oh what? How the f- No! <laughs> uh, I'm going to drop. Oh fuck him. See you, Fatty. Uh, let me move, please. Game, thank you. Ah! Uh, uh. Later. Ah, shoot ya! What up? What? Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. I found where I need to go. I'm gonna juke you again. guy looks super unwell. Nudge. Where the fuck am I going anymore? Because paperwork. Berlin, blah blah blah. I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work of Dr. Rudolf Wernicke in his development of the morphogenic engine, expanding on theories developed in his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turing. Oh, if I had not witnessed it myself, I would not believe it had happened, but beyond even the promise in cellular regeneration and guided cancer to Bob Jabob, I believe Wernicke's method has reached the spiritual realm. Something crossed from the other side. I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition. Briefly, but undeniably so. Please forward my note and invitation to witness further experiments to Dietrich Eckerhardtar. I do not doubt that the Fuhrer himself may need to be aware of our discoveries. It is my opinion that Dr. Wernicke's successes represent an enormous opportunity for our cause and the German people, and are obviously sufficient reasons to keep him out of any sort of culling program. Regards to your family, signature out. Nyeh. Illegible. Still trying to follow the fucking blood. Wait, is this where I got knocked the fuck through the window? Yes, it is! <gasps> cool! Um, so where the fuck is the priest, man? Behind the light. You have to see the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Hey. I need your help. Where are you? Yes, coming! I'm coming! Yeah, you get a little bit of brain there. Okay, okay, somehow. Yeah, on the key.
we be no mouth motherfucker? States. I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English birds are insufficient. More than hope. A human mind in that environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... A proximity to death. To overwhelming madness. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. Do you think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing is supernatural. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? Great. Open the fucking door.
Ah. Ah, fuck. I don't remember how I got here. Oh, naked bro? Naked bro. Hi, naked bro. Hi, naked bro. I don't know why the fuck you didn't come after me. Also a cool shot. that I must something in the picture.
Ah, I thought so. Static again. Patient knelt in prayer. Maybe he bought Father Martin's line of bullshit. Maybe he hears what I hear, but more clearly. Maybe it's his way out of this place. <clears throat> the priest called it the Gospel of Sand. Unworthy supplicant who can serve our Lord only by feeding our Lord. Please take me, Wall Rider. Let my shepherd's apostle see it and spread it with his lies for our greater truth. Your time upon the world has come. My flesh longs for your beautiful wraith. My blood is filled with you and waiting to be set free. This is my prayer. Write your gospel in my flesh. realize why the batteries in this camera run out so quickly. It's because it only takes a single AA battery. It's so obvious. was always freedom from death. And, and here it is. You will watch and record my death, my resurrection. And together we will be free. You are no longer in any danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Now, my son, Can't believe Father Martin just went up Jesus Christ himself in shitty ways to die. Wow. Uh, I don't believe I'm going to miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth now, I've got a way out and a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. Uh -huh.
Thank, thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. Giant fucking ears and weird ass heads. I don't know. I don't know anymore. <laughs> yeah, freedom. Fucking wall rider pops out of nowhere. Oh, I forgot about Big Fatty. Holy shit. Ah, uh, how the fuck did I forget about him? Locked up. There we go. Straight up Resident Evil bullshit. Oh, actually fear as well. Project Wall Rider. Author Jennifer Rowland. My 14th autopsy of a Wall Rider patient, showing no more signs of accepting the therapy than any of the others. There have been slight gains in cell migration and morphogenesis, including effects similar to human growth hormone, but nothing to suggest that the uh, stable creation of a sentient independent swarm. So tired, doubting my judgment. I'll submit another request for leave. The psychological cost of using such far gone and further provoked patients is more than I feel I can handle. It may suggest hanging less hope on the far flung theories of a senile Nazi and moving towards using a simpler uh, mechanical engine based on major sperm protein. Definitely suggest harsher chemical restraints. Urkoff security killed patient 921 after he uh, overcame enough tranquilizers to put down a hockey team. Read the hormone therapy is interacting with our chemical restraints in a counterproductive manner. Explosion. Bloody explosion. Oh boy, they took deliveries here. <laughs> Oops. Oh, cool. I'm not fucking going there. I'm gonna fucking go there. <laughs> I 
This is the thing. A few lines of mathematics and algorithm. Reprogram us, turn us into nightmare factories. Members of the dry race board. Give me a hacksaw and a few hours alone with Dr. Vernicki's corpse. I will be dead. qualified for this. the way you die, rip to pieces from the inside, watching your marrow scatter on a concrete wall. You've escaped one hell, Chris Walker, God help me, but I somehow hope you didn't find another. Exactly, how the fuck do I know that asshole's name was Chris Walker? Also, why did I want me to go down that way? I want to go down that way. Alright. Where the fuck does this game want me to walk? To explain. Oh, the I, I, I know. I am supposed to be dead. No, no such luck. I am older than sin, but somehow the only one left because of Billy. The exterminator. He takes care of me. He may think I'm his father. He certainly loves me, the poor idiot. Definitely record. Do you know what this symbol represents? It warns of a nano hazard. Microscopic machines. Technology we have had for decades but never mastered. Urkov discovered in my research a workaround. Turning the cells in the human body into nano factories. It's the natural function of cells to produce molecules. But through psychosomatic direction, we engineered the precise molecules necessary. Mind over body. It was foolish and wrong to think we could control it. To use madmen to make something so strong. You have to stop him to murder Billy. Turn off his life support, his anesthesia. You have to undo what I've done. No one can get out of this place while he lives. You must kill him. Billy! Billy? Are you William? There you are. Uh Thank <laughs> you. 
Fuck that thing. Ah, I fucking knew there was going to be something there. All birth now. Do not worship the swarm, nor allow the delusions of the patients to influence your beliefs. Any sentient being based in this technology will be so far superior to us that illusions of godliness will be reasonable. We've always looked into chaos and called it God. Now we are blessed with sufficient power that such belief could destroy us. Do not be tempted. Remember, you are scientists! Vital system number one: enriched oxygenated per blah 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 from the life support fluid reservoir must be continually flushed and replaced throughout the course of the patient's treatment. Uh, the OP also supplies anesthetics. Any interruptions? Vital system two: electric supply is supplemented and ensured by sublab generator. Proper fueling and maintenance of the sublab generator should be confirmed hourly. Vital system number three: in the case of catastrophic loss, vital system one and two life pod fail safe will engage, maintaining localized minimum life support functions until technicians arrive. Disabling fail safe will result in blah blah blah. Thank you for giving me the three steps I'm going to need to complete in order to kill him. Who the fuck are you? Man, they all look like the fucking Toxic Avenger. Seriously. What was step one? I'm an idiot. I should have been paying attention to that. Life support fluid reservoir. His lungs, his liver, his life support machine the size of a football stadium to keep one lunatic alive. Fuck it all! Stick my dick in all of it. Documents! Frankenstein, the mod Prometheus, by Mary Shelley, published anonymously. Learn from me, if not by my precepts, at least by my example. How dangerous is the acquirement of knowledge, and how much happier that modest man than he who aspires to become greater than nature allows. Where's the off button? Do not turn this valve. Okay. Oh 
city's right there. real quick. Oh, he's in front of me. I'm invincible. Any handprint will do. Yeah, film a man dying.
exit is pretty far. If I have to do this the whole way. Oh no. Meh. How's that last? That was, was okay. <laughs> 